There's a buzz in Pillager, and it all revolves around the football team. The Huskies are a perfect 11-0, ranked third in the state in Class 2A, and are headed to their first state tournament in over a decade. In his first season as head coach at Pillager, Paul Peterson can't help but smile as he talks about the success of his team so far this year. Oh, it's awesome. The kids are working hard. The, the town is just a buzz. It's a, it's a great time right now. The kids worked hard and they've done a lot of good things and, and my coaching staff is top notch. They're a bunch of great guys who really love coaching our kids and it's just kind of coming together right now and hopefully we can keep this thing going. Peterson's Huskies are state bound for the first time in 14 years, but they say they aren't phased a bit. It's really exciting. I mean, it's great opportunity that we've been given just to go out and just play more football. I mean, that's always fun. You just want to keep playing as long as you can. It's just another game to them a lot of times. They, they're they not feeling the pressure of the, the big game. It's, it's just another game for them. Pillager has averaged nearly 40 points per game on offense this season, while allowing only an average of eight on defense. And while they hope their offense continues to roll, they know they'll need their defense to survive in advance. We need to play sound team defense, swarm to the football, and we need to make a couple big plays on special teams. We need those bonus plays. And if we get those, I think things will be good. I think we're just going to have to play the best football of the year. I mean, because these are the best teams we've played all year. And I mean, I think we're going to have to put our best foot forward and just um, see where we go from there and just play our best football. And although 11 chapters have already been written in this storybook season for Pillager, a few remain blank and the Huskies hold the pen to write the ending. It should be a lot of fun. I mean, I think we can play with anyone that's left, I mean, but yeah, it'll be fun. I mean, Barnesville and whoever we have after that will be really tough, but I mean, it'll be, it'll be good. I'll just take one game at a time, win this one, win the next one, just keep going. And we just want to keep going, get the U.S. Bank Stadium. We have a bunch of guys that like playing together. I love coaching them, and uh, they're just gelling. And it's, and it's a football family atmosphere, and hopefully the family can get her done. And that game will be tomorrow in Moorhead at 7 o'clock p.m. as Barnesville takes on Pillager in the Class 2A state quarterfinals. If you've enjoyed this segment of Lakeland News, please consider making a tax-deductible contribution to Lakeland Public Television.